that she's famous. Yeah. Or infamous. Famous? <laughs> <laughs> you can't say that. All right, so before the girls get here, well, yeah. they will be here. They're, they're coming. They're, they're getting a couple at the moment, and they'll okay. be here. Right. Right. Steve, Yo. did you try the Florentine? Was it fair? Who's Florentine? The Florentine, the bicky that Margaret left you. The fruit biscuit. Oh, really good, thanks. Okay. Oh, you're welcome. You're going to try a yo-yo as well? You bet I am. <laughs> In fact, if you do both of them, you're doing us a favour, because otherwise I'll eat it. Wasn't that the plan? That we ate? Are we not eating these? Are these just Yeah, no, but I don't need the other two on the bench as well. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's just getting it too fast. Daniel tells me I need more icing in them. And I just think, but they get so sweet, you know, like it's just like... Ugh. I don't want to eat them that much. I don't think so. Right. I can't believe how long my hair is when you see it on the side like that. Is it bugging you? My hair? Yeah. Or watching myself? Her hair's alright, isn't it? It's perfectly fine. So do you want to know who's here? Because this is oh, where we do. Have yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a cup of tea. I'll tell you who's here. Okay. Because we just yeah, we've been busy. We've just sat down, and so what we do at the start is we go. This is Margaret, by the way. You all know, right? Um, Margaret's here today. I don't even know what camera I'm looking at. <laughs> that one. Okay. So just oh, so you see this one eyes. here. That one. Yeah. That's the one that's live at any time. Okay. You right. You got I'm it. Good. I'm good. I'm good. No good. Okay. So what we do at the start. As we do rumpus room right because yep. we go hello louise louise is always first on i don't know how she does it but she's lou you're always up first no golf today i'm assuming that was golf on a wednesday if i got it wrong francis is here diane's here now we have two diane we have a diana we have a diana very important not to get them mixed up diana diane is here and she's our virtual merchandising marketing person so she she pointed out yesterday that we had one of our fat eight packs around the wrong way on the stand so I, we we talk about you and we figure that you're in marketing oh which reminds me too steve realized today we actually missed putting one of our fat eight packs up yesterday with the northcote shimmers so it's up there now and all the specials are still up from yesterday that are available and there's two banners now he's done that thing again where there's two banners going round and round so then we have diana's here from costa rica Excellent. How good's that? How's the weather? How's the weather in Costa Rica? We're not going yet. Just because Karen's off swanning it. Oh, I know. Have you seen her photo? Yep. Yeah, not I talking know. about it. She says, nice to meet you, Margaret. Barb Lawrence is here. Karen's here. Nancy's here. Um, will the biscuits be suitable for us at the soiree? Fiona, you've asked the exactly right question. Yes, these biscuits are on the menu at the soiree. See, look, we can do that, Mark. We can overhead. Look at that. Oh, See? That's amazing. That's on my... Um, Carlton Ware. Carlton Fox Ware. glove. From the Parkdale Ops. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh. I've got I've got big boxes of Carlton Ware. Have I've, you? Yes, I used to have cabinets of Carlton Ware. Oh. And it doesn't quite go in my new house, so it's in mm -hmm. boxes. But I do love it. Michelle Fisher's here. Mm -hmm. And we love Michelle Fisher. <laughs> we love Michelle Fisher. Michelle Fisher has officially supplied the jam... For Rob's buttermilk scones at the soiree, which is Sunday. Only Sunday. Only Sunday. Yeah, like he'll only bake one day and Sunday. He is only it. available for scone manufacturing on the Sunday. Sunday. If you're coming on the Sunday, you'll get Rob arrived with scones. There's a whole team in. What's Ralph bringing? The cream. <laughs> the cream. Oh, of course. <laughs> bring the cream. Of course he would. Um, good afternoon, Sylvia. Now, Sylvia is one of our girls coming from Northern Vic. I okay. think. No, Sylvia, where are you? Anyway, they're coming for the weekend. They've booked somewhere to stay. They're in for the wow. two days. Oh, it'll be such fun. It'll be really it's, good fun. And I think we deserve it after all of the, the last couple of years to get together and just be girly. We do need to be girly. Mm -hmm. Now, Yvonne mm -hmm. Collins, we've got our pearls on, because mm -hmm. we're wearing our pearls. Mm -hmm. Yvonne Collinson is here. <laughs> what are we looking there for? Because <laughs> I'm looking for what she sent me. It's over there somewhere. So I did... Yvonne, it was, it was a Quilter's Life a demo, and we use a cuticle stick for positioning and doing uh, oh, pre-shaping. And I was doing pre-shaping. finding that amongst them. And I couldn't find it. I was sending off Rob looking for my, in my office. So what did I get from Yvonne in the mail? A pack of cuticle sticks for Easter. Excellent. Excellent. <laughs> Love you. Thanks. 
it, it there was laughs there was lots and lots of laughs it was really good um and she's on her way back from holidays at the moment good afternoon Rhonda good afternoon oh hi Bobby Yvonne's actually connected to Qantas Wi-Fi at 30,000 feet at the moment wow she said she was on her way back today hello Kathy and Lynette Fiona says your hair's gorgeous who's yours Oh, okay. You should probably see me in short hair. I'm years. going with Mum tomorrow because yep. it's, it's got to look good for the soiree. Oh, Michelle's just joined the block of the month. Awesome. Okay, so Sue McGonchi, Karen Carter's here from Kuala Lumpur. Good. They, I, I don't think she's coming to the soiree. You just never know. <laughs> yeah, just never know. Yeah. No, she's just been and left again. Hello, Vicky. Hello, Cheryl. Jackie. Uh, yeah, we're a bit excited here too. Uh, Helen Hazel. Hello, mate. How are you? Uh, Karen's not long back from the hairdressers either, so it's all on. Tina's here from Newcastle. Pam Stanton's in. Pauline Boyke is here from Blackbutt. With her, look, she's got her little Ulysses butterfly. See, oh, she's good. Um, Meredith's here again today. Thank you for joining us again. I thought we would have put you off. Bobby, the background is divine because it's all Mark stuff. It is all <laughs> Margaret <laughs> stuff for a, a change. change. So yes, it's gorgeous. Joan Cockersy. Look, all my all my girls are here to out and oppress. It's hot under the lights. <laughs> yeah, that's what the patterns are for. It is. Um, I'll, I'll put a little fan on over there for you oh, in a minute. Okay. It'll go. Um, Steve, Pam Santon said her scrumptious patent parcel arrived yesterday. It's scrumptious. Beautiful. Beautiful. Um, Sumi Gonchi. They are now on my website. She's just said, I can't see all your stitcheries. Oh, I know. Uh, oh. And they are now on my website after much nagging. Today. And, yes, today. today. Um, it was a deadline too far. But anyway, so they're up now. now. They're on both. They're on both. So they're here. Yeah. They're there. We're very excited that they're here as well. Sharon Keyes is here from Keysborough. Excellent. She says, that's not fair. There's no scones on Saturday. Come but on. there's other stuff Saturday. Look, yes, but, but if you're you on Saturday, you can also come Sunday. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> she's naughty. That's so weird. I can only get him. See, Sylvia's coming from New Merck. They're yeah. coming down from New Merck. Well, ask them what they think of a... I, I sourced an amazing little hall on the other side of the city, north of the city. Tell me, tell her where it is. Pardon? Tell them where it is. No, you can. Oh, okay. So the next one you won't have to come as far because the next one's in the Gamby. <laughs> so that's a, we're going up, aren't we? Before the soiree. Yes, we've got to s sort out a date and um, requirements and things. So, but it's looking good. And they've got a lovely old hall there with great lighting. It's the and mechanics. It's Institute. the me old, old mechanics yeah. institute. We're going country. Uh, yeah. Well, that's the point, isn't it? Yeah. We it is. we, we we think that the city girls do okay. And we'd like to do some fun things in the country. That'd be good. That'd be good. Hello, Jenny. Jenny Miller's here too. You don't know yet, but she's coming to the okay. soiree. Right? Excellent. So it's all good. All right. Yeah. So we've we started the day uh, with breakfast, <laughs> which is not normal for us to go out for breakfast. But we did. We started the day, and we've been talking soiree and plans um, of what we're going to do together as projects. What we're going to do after the soiree, before the soiree. There's lots of stuff that we've been talking about all day to the point where we decided we might need an afternoon um, nap and then realised we couldn't. No. It was a, we were a little bit busy. Steve said no and so here we are. Um, but yes, we were going to eat these on camera and now I don't, I think, don't think I want to feed my face. So they're your yo-yos, your Florentines. They are the... They don't... My bits don't look that good because they are the yes, pieces. Yes, they taste amazing. They I've, are the I've pieces sampled, that are left. I sampled two before they hit the plate. Did you have two? I did, I did. Oh, you didn't okay. see me, but I'm a little piggy. Truly. All right, so we've got tea down here, which we'll yep. have to be really careful of. We'll move that. Yeah. So I'll put this... I'll put <laughs> this to another the side excellent. It'll be good. Oh, shut up. We are not got you. <laughs> no, don't. There was, there was an incident good. with an iron. Um... Oh, Sharon can't come on the... Well, you could come on the Sunday, but it's her birthday on the Sunday. That's why. Oh, that's all right. We'll have cake. Oh, yeah, Nancy. The Gamby's only half an hour from you. Awesome. Yeah. 
I used to live in Nagambi, so I know all of those little towns. Whereas, uh, so Nan, so mum and dad were dairy farmers at Tat. So um, we know it well. Oh, we had mm -hmm. Angela's friends that lived in Kyabram and yeah. I, and I used to shop she in I, Shepparton. No, they were just bragging that. I used to, I helped build dairy, dairy Planet Strathy. Mm -hmm. There you go. So you're abbreviating. I still like the whole name. You know, Tat, Strathmore. Kai, Shep, Yamurk. Yeah. I never abbreviate Marupna though. <laughs> or Karang. Rochi? No. Come on. No, can't. <laughs> can't do it. It's, 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 it's fun. Actually, no, because I told you that my uncle was um, an orchardist at TAT for the Pickworths. Okay. Let me just put these somewhere safe. Like in front of Steve, that's probably not safe. I don't think that's safe. I think it's a given that they'll be gone. But it'll save our waistline. Correct. Mm -hmm. Correct, correct, correct. All right, so we've got heaps of Margaret stuff here today, and we, I wanted to have the opportunity not just to talk about the soiree, Mm -hmm. But so many people haven't seen you. Oh, I know. I've been hiding. Forever. No. Um, it's been, uh, what, was it three years now since we've been able to have a show yeah. in Melbourne? So AQC and Melbourne Quilt and Craft and Sydney and Brisbane and Perth. I mean, it all went by the wayside. So but I've been busy. You have. I have, but not necessarily with, um, I've, I've done some embroidery, but I did a... I did certificate four in bookkeeping and accounting, and everyone that says was why. Fun. No, it wasn't fun, and um, but I passed, and now I have a certificate, and it was to take over the bookkeeping of the family business, and then when I finished it, I realised I don't really want to do that. <laughs> so I um, yeah, I've taken up my embroidery again after two years of study, and um, put some new pieces together, re-ramped some old things, and. That's what I've done. There you go. Yeah. Uh, Denise, you'll be able to see her there. And Denise is going to AQC. Okay, good. So she'll be there. Oh, Brisbane. And poor Cheryl um, can't come to the soiree. And she lives in Cooey Rock because she's away. So she misses it. Oh, so she'll just Cheryl, have to go. Cheryl, Cheryl Blay. Okay. So she'll just yes, have hi, to. Hi, Cheryl. I know Cheryl. Do you? So she'll yeah. just have to get in the car and yeah. come up. Yeah. We'll do. I'm sure we'll do more at the Garfield Hall. Well, we are going to do We more. are going to do a bit more at the Garfield Hall. It's a, I feel that it's a, a good location because it's only it's really only an hour from Melbourne, from this side yeah. of Melbourne. Yeah. Um, easy drive, um, easy to find, good parking, and also coming from the other side, coming from Gippsland side, it's, you know, our... Our, mm. it's good got a good capture site and, and, and it's good hall good lighting good facilities so and you need to explain you're there this well we're this we're there with you this weekend that's right so what this weekend this weekend um i also uh, work for a group called foster parents indonesia where we sponsor eight different orphanages in indonesia and we do um a, a, a quite a few uh, fundraisers and this weekend's fundraiser is a high tea and that's at the Garfield Hall. It's a fabulous event and uh, Lisa has <laughs> Lisa <laughs> enlisted <laughs> Robert and yeah, myself uh, yeah that's it to uh, work this weekend. Yes yeah, so she is going to be waiting and she's going to be Hello. cleaning she's Wait, going to have her hands in the dishwasher your hands in but the dishwasher. I was dish swimming around doing the maitre d' thing. Anyway uh, yeah, she is and she's selling raffle tickets like um, only Lisa could. Oh yeah I can yeah. tell <laughs> um, and we yeah. are doing it as well because it's in the hall and then yeah. I can get in there because Fiona wanted to know if she could use the microwave for her lunch and I that I don't know, but I'll yeah. be there this weekend. There's a, and there's a microwave there, and we'll there's a great out. big stove, there's a great big fridge, there's everything. We've got everything. Good. We've got and everything. the lighting's good. Anyway, yeah. so that's that's yeah. on. Um, but I want to go back first. I want to go way back hmm? to candle wicking. I thought you wanted to go way back as to when we met. Oh, <laughs> uh, Margaret. Yeah, yeah you can <laughs> go back that far. Margaret had this young, flipping, upstart thing come up to her when she was very, very busy at a Sydney crafting. Oh, one of those, one of those. So, Sydney yeah. Craft. Sydney? Was it Sydney or Melbourne? Yeah, it was Sydney because okay. I was up there having a look around with uh, Tim and okay. thinking about doing it and I idolised this person and her merchandising. So I went and pestered her and asked her if she had any advice and she had some very savoury advice. Don't do it. <laughs> yeah, mad. Um, no. Yeah, that's when we met. So that's... I, yeah. Steve was 
four. Yeah, it was only tiny. It only tiny. tiny. And then we came back and doubled up and did Melbourne after that, and that oh. was on. Oh. So we that's how long. Since. We have, yeah. we have but we COVID, have. COVID, uh, and well, yeah. and most of us will find that we have some go-to people, and we do. There's a few of us in our industry because we couldn't work anymore, and it it was a bit um, unfulfilling, for want of a better word. And it was really great to have some people that you could just ring up and just talk a lot of a lot of rubbish with, and they understood exactly what you were talking about. You know, and our creative dreams and the ones that were on hold and the ones that were still in the pipeline. And now... That was good. It's all come back to bite us because we're out and about and we can actually do it, so yeah, there's no excuses. Okay. And then, 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 now we have to um, eat our words. We do. Yeah. All right, so yeah. I think for those... Nancy Cook said her first quilt was a, um, a candle wicking quilt. Yeah. So I think we should go way, way back. Mm -hmm. And can we show... You want to go to... Do you want to go to 1821? I want to go to 1821 1821. Can I, do you want me to... Have you got it? I've or? got it. I've got it. I don't trust it. you with it. <laughs> I'm not having this discussion anymore <laughs> today. Someone used the steam shot on my iron that hadn't been used for a very long time. And it's sitting drying out the back, isn't it, at the moment? <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. Oh, gee, that's okay. yours. I nearly drank yours. Hang on. Yeah. All right. Where do you think you're going to place this? So we can hold up, but we can okay. also lay down. I think. Oh, do you want me to put the overhead on for a minute, and then yeah. you can lay it out yeah. and okay. show the girls. This is. So that's what they can the quilt see. that I purchased in Houston a few, well, quite a few years ago. So, it's there. Yeah, so yeah. is that a good that's close it. up? Yeah, it's a good close up, and it's one of. There we go. It's the name M, I think that's a T, MTS, 1821. You so I'll be taking this to the soiree for anybody that wants a closer look. There it is. Look, look, look. there yeah. it is. So so this is real 1821 yeah. Candlewick. Is, this is the Candlewick embroidery. Often people, when they talk about Candlewicking, they think of those chenille bedspreads. That's not Candlewicking, mm -hmm. that is a chenille bedspread. This is the genuine article. Um, got a great medallion piece in the middle, I'm just so you're your not tea. going to be so that able we can, to um, hold it up. Yeah. Okay. Tease up with the iron. Up there, How and I'll going? move mine. How are we go. You can see that centre medallion. There we go. Like that. Can we see that? So if I put it back on the front, hang on. If I push this, and now they can see. There you go. Yes. Look at that. Yeah. Isn't that amazing? Yeah, it is. It's fabulous. I just love it. Um, so you got this to in Lisa America, that did it's, you? it's still got it's still on the got some soiling and that on there, but I'm too scared to have it cleaned. Um, so but, how how would they have transferred the pattern on? I'd say black lead pencil, Frixion pen. Yeah, yeah, black lead pencil. Black lead and pencil. and I think that's why things aren't always 100 percent even. Mm. Um, but I would, like I said to Lisa early on. What kind of needle? Two hundred years. You know, we have the most fabulous needles now that are made in Germany or, or um, Japan, and this this is all bullion stitch here and here. It's all all bullion. We all know how easy that's not to do. Um, I just wonder what sort of needle. And for all of those that question the back of their work and or or have had their back of their work criticised. Um, there's the back of this lady's work. There's a couple of little men's in there that I find interesting. But, you know, and knots. Nice big fat knots. Anyway, it's a, um, it's a fun piece. Oh, there's a, there's a little man. Look at that. Cassandra Cass said she wants to pat it. What is that? A mend. It's been mended. Look how well oh. I made it. They've even lined up the... I've got you on there. Look, see, yeah. so you can hold you hold up there. Yeah. Look at that. Hmm. There's a couple of little ones, like there's some in the corners and things where... Because you can see it's been used. Yeah. Look, even the hem has been embroidered on. Anyway, I think it's a wonderful piece and I, I love, love looking at it. And um, it's been a great inspiration to me. And you can see the thickness of the thread sort of bona fides my work in the thicker thread. There you go. When 
when I first met you, so you, it's a wool, isn't it? When I have seen cotton. your kits, it's a cotton. It's a cotton. It's a, it's cotton, a knitting cotton. A knitting cotton. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And this. And I wouldn't know what ply this is, but this is much thicker than I've ever used. Like I said, I don't know what kind of a needle she would have used. Look, look, see, that's the thickness. So, of yeah, so... So that would be like a 16 ply or 20 ply. Some, the of the, some of the research that that I've seen, as I said to you before, they were using bone. Mm. They were just using like a well, chicken bone. I'm just wondering whether like a bagging needle. Yeah. yeah. And the other thing is that fabrics in that time were only ever 36 inches, always three foot. And they've mm. used... Three three widths and stitched it together to create that big cloth. Amazing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And look, even that's been done yeah. beautifully. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. Alright, mm -hmm. do you want me to take this go. and I'll put it somewhere safe? And Ginny is outside I'll and I've got my Colour Stay lipstick on so it doesn't come off <laughs> on anything. Okay, here's another piece that. Um, purchased over there and the the whole quilt was destroyed other than this piece and I so I let people handle that one just to, mm. to see the fabric type and I don't know I don't so know what, what is they, this fabric Margaret? I don't know what they call it I think it's like a it's like a corded or a yeah, woven it's, a, yeah, like it's a woven and then there's one thick like we uh, call that a Japanese slub now but yeah, but but a slub is uneven. Oh, a slub uneven. is all over whereas this is one like a cord that's gone through like every sixth um, thread in the weave. But yeah, yeah, I thought that was a bit of fun too. Incredible. So. Yeah. So there's there's my inspiration, and uh, having looked at the back of the work and there are knots in it, you don't have to feel bad about having knots yeah. in the back Fiona, of your work. Fiona, she said she loves knots in the back. I do too. <laughs> <laughs> they hold the front together. That's all that happens on the back of mine. You get a knot. Mm. You get a knot whether you want it or not. Um, Sharon said, does it have a French, does it have French seams to join the strips? No. No? No, no, it's not French seams, it's just overstitched over really, um, really finely. Beautiful. Mm. Yeah. Alright, and then from there, where shall we go? Will we go here? We can go there. We can go there. So there, I don't think I've got, oh, that's probably one of my earlier, but this is, I, uh, for yeah. photography, it's really difficult to um, photograph any of my work. You know, it always just look like a white sheet. So I've done this one on the white embroidery on mm -hmm. a taut linen. So that's Gorgeous. what this is. And these are, are slightly bigger designs than my others. And so if they, we, we might yeah. put it back on the front. We've sort of, we're such, we're kind of stuck with space today, but mm. the girls can see that yeah. there. Yeah, that, so is that's this a fun. So is this a this is a pattern. This is a pattern so, is called Claire, and it also is pre-printed um, into quilt kits. Yeah. So, so Steve has spent the morning mm. tolerating. Oh, he loves me. He does love you. <laughs> you get a you get an elephant stamp. He loves you. <laughs> he loves you. No. Um, it, Steve spent the morning uploading everything that we've got here onto our website under the second banner that's up for today. So everything that we're showing you is is up in there if you want to get it which is really really nice margaret hasn't bought a lot no um and i don't you know, that, you know, know why you know why you know why thing. no is i thought I, apart from the candle wicking books oh the candy wicking books aren't up no, oh okay candle wicking books are on your website then. yeah okay but he can do them after the show there's no hurry they've got to watch yeah, first <laughs> they're going to have to watch first and he yeah. also said combined shipping so if we're doing combined shipping, you've got to have it in by 4 tomorrow. 4 p.m. tomorrow. Please. Please. Which will be Thursday the 28th. <coughs> so also really? known as hair day. <laughs> nah. Okay. For, because then, because he's got to fit it in. He's doing an, He's actually fitting in an extra shift to get the orders done because of today's show. That's the, that's mm. the kind of guy he is. I love this. I really, this, it's classy. It's it's, it's, it's timeless. And it's, it's timeless. It's timeless. It goes into any decor. Um, uh, you know, some of the girls like less. This has got no lace on it, and that's what probably gives it the the. Oh uh, uh, yeah, the more contemporary look. The contemporary look. Um, but if you want that more authentic look, there's lace. Um, yeah, Lynette's yeah. a big fan. She loves all your stuff. Yeah, well, good. Thank you. 
She loves it. Yeah. All right. But so it's great therapy. That's the other thing. You know, like it's something that you sit down. Yeah. All, all of our kids are, ex except the tiny ones, but they're getting redone. They're pre-printed. So you pull it out oh, of this plastic really bag. Old. Yeah, your plastic bag. You put it into a hoop and you start embroidery. So there's no delay on the process. So if you think, I'd like to do some embroidery, and you think, oh, I've got to get out the light box and I have to get out the And I think, just well... I can't be bothered. Not today. Well, the ones like these, yeah. and these ones that Steve's going to put up, it's so... It, oh, I got it, I got it, I got it. Don't you dare move. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, it's so important, I think, that they are pre-printed. Mm. Because, I mean, these these ones are not of Mark, so you can yeah, buy you, these. You can, you can trace them on. That's you fine. can trace them on. So it depends, depends what you're happy to do. So these are... Oh, these. Um, they all work together. I, I've got to say, that's the look. other thing that they all be. I've made sized them all the same in these books. Yeah. So that if you fancy something out of one book and you fancy something out, they all tie together. Oh, uh, they so all fit together. Not, you know how you, you see designs sometimes, and they've got these small things sitting in the middle, and then you've got a bigger one, and everything looks a little mismatched. These all tie will tie together. So. So. May I? Steve's standing here taking them off. Would you like me to tag the embroidery hoops? Uh, no, because Mark's got better ones. She's going to do a demo. Oh, I'm doing a demo. Uh, yeah, I thought you were a demo. <laughs> of course we can. So, it's all good. It's all good. She can wing it. She's a professional. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, may I put my hat on for a minute? I love yeah. these, but if I wasn't just candle wicking, yeah. And my Quilters Life Girls, if you have watched what I did last night and put up under AQL Makes on creating your own quilt designs, quilting designs, look at these and think about them as quilting designs and also look at them for applique and mm. bias work and inserts yeah. because you could just take some of these and blow them up mm. and use them for heaps of different things. So yeah. when I look at them, I look at them a bit differently. Then, are these the Celtic ones? The green books, Celtic, yeah. Yeah, see, some of these, this to me is, they're quilting designs and they're, and they're bias work designs. Look at them. Let me show you when you had that one pattern. Oh, oh, oh. my instructions. <gasps> there are left-handed instructions in the book. Of course there are. Oh, by the way, anyone coming to the soiree that's a left-handed, don't hide. Do not hide under, uh, you know, and with the, and pretend you you can embroider with your right hand. Just tell us, because we have a left-handed in the in the building, we have and and I can actually embroider. embroider with the left hand. She can do both, so that's fine. I no. did those instead of doing those. I I downsized them. This is a when I was saying I brought some things that I'm working on. There's a lot of stuff she's working. Yeah, on. I know. There's lots of stuff, and nothing's finished. These are, um, I've got over 30 different um, tulip designs in amongst my... Gee, I wonder um, why that is. <laughs> you dutchy. Um, and, <laughs> and so I downsize those. They're down 50% on the ones that you just saw. Mm. And they're going to be going into, I think they're going to do a table runner with those and I'll just build it up with blue... And um, would you like a Dutch fabric range to go with those, Margaret? Could you do one? I can. I've done it before, and I'm going to do it again. Okay. I'm going to do it again. Excellent. <laughs> so, oh, well, yeah. Moving. There you can, go. Can you match it with the threads? Sure. It's easier that way. It's called a pitch sheet and a Pantone book. It's, okay. Um, well, I've got all of these plans. I really, my dream after having, after doing all of the soirees <laughs> on the country, around the country, is to put a Delft Blue book together with. Dutch inspiration, not necessarily Dutch, but in inspired Dutch. Is so, there cake recipes in there too? Oh, some speaker glass and some on bake cook. What you said, yes. <laughs> what you said, yes. All right, they're gorgeous. All right. So, uh, so yeah, that's on the to do Have you written that on the to do list? That's Dutch uh, fabric, Dutch stitchery, right? Okay, okay. good. I oh, don't worry, the public make you accountable. Do they? Yeah. <laughs> if you say it, if you say it for long enough, it, it, it just has happens. To, it has to happen. Should we hold some of these? Oh, Because yeah, okay. this is I what know, I felt. I don't know if you can see. Yeah, they go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can yeah. see it. Can, they can see it. 
Okay, well this Just one, so you this one's Zara. This is called, the, I named them after my granddaughters. Um, well, you do too. Yeah, yeah so. That. So what, what we'll do, just so, yeah, we'll do. Is that your phone? I know, I should put on song. She didn't put her phone on song. It's on the kitchen sink. Um, <laughs> Steve's got it. Oh, just okay. so, there you go. So you can see a little close up there. Yeah. So it's ever so subtle and yeah, it's, it's delicate tiny, tiny. and, you know, be look. Yeah, and just beautiful. Just you just keep candle wicking is not designed to be an intricate form of embroidery. It's designed to be a simple form of embroidery. Thick threads, simple background, so it's tone on tone. Um, and so it's tactile and it's textural. So it's yeah. really and it's therapeutic. Mm. Karen Dewilt, um, you did marry into a Dutch family. Is Dewilt Dutch? Mm. Must be. Sylvia's, oh, Sylvia's Dutch and loves tulips. Oh, we're in good company. We are absolutely in good Who company. Who doesn't love tulips? Who doesn't? Yeah. Beautiful. Okay. So what's this? What, this is Zara. Zara. Yeah, Zara. This is and that's, Zara. Um, and all of those designs are round. So. And this is the Celtic one over here then? Mm-hmm. That's right. the Celtic, but the Zara is also in this comes as is this one here oh as is well. that sorry there too yeah oh okay so we're doing here. so there, see there are 12 in there and the other 12 are in that one <laughs> so this one oh that's come out of the ava may book and i just did that i, I was working on a stand and How someone asked me you know it doesn't look like in color so then i pulled four balls of color out and just put it together Ooh. So, what in your hotel room very, at night time? No, on the stand amongst the customers. Oh, Cheryl's know. doing Cheryl's doing Zara at the moment. Good. Is that? Oh, it's a, it's a nice. They're nice designs. She'll be happy with it. <laughs> She'll be happy with it. Yeah, she will be happy with it. I love them. You know, I go. You know, there's some. As you grow, I know where with we're having work, the lunch. Holland. <laughs> Oh, the Kirkenhof in Holland in May. I was going to say the Tesla Chillip Farm. Oh, <laughs> but it's sure. A budget. <laughs> sure, sure. We can, we can, sure. We'll, uh, sure, Holland's fine. Yeah. Except none of the girls will be with us. Oh, they'll be with us in spirit. We'll, 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 do, we'll do lives from there. We'll send them all. And, and when you launch it, when we launch, we have to all send them a little uh, thing of Dutch licorice. It goes uh. without saying. Do you remember my boys at AQC when I launched the Dutch I did, I did. I had them all given out. Poor little devils. Poor I've, ex I've, I've exploited mine too, used to have um, uh, cup day sales, and I made them all little jockey outfits, and I made them wear <laughs> I know, oh, the exploitation of children. Steve thinks he had it rough. <laughs> I, um, no. I do not think so. Uh, no, now now you've set the bench. The <laughs> no, 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 yeah. I know, and now I've got grandchildren, but I don't have a shop. So, yeah, is this so? This is Zara. Yes, is Zara as well in colour. Yeah, and this I've just done. I I had a, yeah. a bolt of grey linen. I've still got some more grey linen, and I put this. And this is all pre-printed on. Yes, yeah. So if yeah. you get this kit, yeah, or whatever you do, it's printed. So yes. in fact, I have one in my cupboard, don't I? Yes, you do. Oh, yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah, she does. I don't I haven't done it. So I'm doing mine. Just in um, variegated grey on mm -hmm. grey. Yeah. Anyway, beautiful. Like I said, the the designs are really fun to do. And once you start, you don't want to go to bed at night. You keep stitching. Yes, you do. Yeah. Mm. Texting me at messaging me at flipping eleven eight pm because she's I don't still expect going. You to answer. <laughs> and what? <laughs> Got to put it on silent. Put it on silent. So that one, I love that. Absolutely. With love the grey. Yeah, I love the okay. grey. But I also think that that grey is really nice because if you were doing this for a young lady, mm. it would you could do this for a ten-year-old, yeah. and they would still love it, and grow into it, and grow into it because mm. they would look at these colours when they're younger, but it would still be contemporary later on. Yeah, I think it also looks really nice with the grey on the grey or the white on the grey. That looks pretty stunning too. And I didn't bring that sample. Sorry. Next time, see, you always have to leave something for next time. Uh, <laughs> uh, Catherine, so you have to understand, some of my girls are a hoot, okay. but they're all a hoot. Um, so Catherine Dow said, afternoon everyone, sorry I'm late, here's my note, was babysitting, because they've got to bring a note oh. if they're late. Honestly, I understand that babysitting I don't, I don't do that thing, I just slip, well when I'm watching Natasha, I just like to, sometimes I just 
slide in and hope no one notices I'm late if she's doing a show and my stuff. Yeah. But yeah, some of them just like to know I do that two text at stupid o'clock and it don't expect to an answer because I'm not no. stitching. Fiona, that's Fiona and Fiona yeah. know because she does night shift. Yeah, I, I just think, oh well, you know, they haven't switched it off and they've got it under their pillow, that's their problem. What's this one I precariously oh, put up? Butterflies and flowers. Oh, so that's the butterfly and flower yeah. that we have. Oh, oh. Yeah. And what I did with that one, see I'm not much of a quilter, um, in fact I don't really actually like quilting that much. Uh, I like piecing, I like embroidering, I like playing but I think quilting is work so this one I made it as least work as I could I cross hatched it so cross hatch right up to the design either way and it's given it a very traditional look so sorry and Brand's just I've just gone into uh, did, did you thinking how can she not like quilting no, That's no I, didn't I didn't say that, that. Yeah. Didn't say that. no but you were thinking it I can, can tell I, yeah because because of what Emma and I were doing yesterday, and it's not on the stand, because I ran out of rooms, but I have yeah. shown Margaret what we were doing yesterday. I'm going to finish it off. And Denise, Margaret will have that wall hanging I was working on yesterday at AQC in mm -hmm. Brisbane, so she'll bring it up. But um, we were messing around with before and after quilting applique. Can you, could you quilt on thin pallen first and candle wick through it? Yes. So you could do that yep. and then perhaps just go back around the candle wicking bit or something late. If you want to, yeah. I so did this can. as a quilt as you go, so the, oh, the yeah, blocks yeah. were, you know, oh, that's why. they're I, all done. Yeah, I've done them all as quilt as you go. So, well, that and that's sense. the other thing, you know, like that's made it possible for me to to actually finish a quilt. Um, otherwise, So that's what's under all the lace. Yeah. Where it's all yeah, that's right, yeah. It's good, isn't it? I have lost respect now. <laughs> it's easier than I thought. <laughs> It's easier than uh, I thought. Yeah, yeah. Do, right. you, do you want to do the last white one? Or are you saving that? No. No, that's the... Um, this is the Celtic. Yes, the Celtic. It's Celtic. And that was one of my er that's one of my earlier ones. And I used 8-ply there. So it's thicker. And... But it's harder. So that. that's do. why we only do 4-ply now. <laughs> I have more complaints so about we, the of the thread. So we'll, um, we'll have to come back around with this one when I've done the Scottish range. Mm. Okay. No problem. After the Dutch range. Yeah, there's a bit yeah, of that. Uh, you know, I've got no allegiance to the Scots, sorry. I am. Yeah, I'm no, you do, Scott. but I don't. I'm quarter Scot. No, I see, I'm, you know, like, my sister, I'm my sure sister's you done the DNA um, testing, and we're 95% Dutch blood, and uh, there's 1% Portuguese, and there's some Viking blood, and that would, uh, you know, the I blonde and the height. Yeah, yeah, well, we height. didn't adjust the cameras today. I decided we'd just chop the top of her head off. <laughs> Dad's got Spanish. Okay, that's funny. Yeah, that's weird, and we're trying to work that one out. Well, I think you've got to think they were seafarers, and, you know, they dropped off in all sorts of ports. Oh, I'm sure they did. And that's where the Portuguese came from. I'm yeah. sure they did. Okay. All right, let's do the baby ones. Okay, I've Little got... Thing. I do have four baby quilts, and there's three here. And this is the bear... The bear one? The bear one. Yeah. The bear. Yeah. The bear hunt. You hold that size. Yep. And this is one of my earliest, earliest. It, but it's so, so a lot of people have done this one. Beautiful. And this year I just did it in colour because um, it was called for. People asked me to do it in colour. So what would it look like in colour? So here it is in colour. It's gorgeous. But once again, I don't like... I don't like making work out of my embroidery, so I use the same. If I choose a variegated thread, then that's the thread I use all the way through. I don't try and pull it apart and make brown bears and red hearts and, you know. So I'll leave that up to other people. So it's this the is one, just all it's, the one it's thread. It's the one thread. And yeah. this is the pearlized cotton? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's number five. And, yeah, I. Candle wicking to me is therapy. And if so you, is it a bit like hand quilting? Some people love that and sashiko. Yes, it's just that. Yeah, and anybody that does candle wicking and a lot of it, it's just a necessity to put all your day's angst into your work, and you come out a happier person. I don't to believe it's you. You come out a happier person. You do. You do. You know the amount of people that have said. That's yeah, true. I, yeah, I have. I have to have at needlework or. And this is one of the simpler things they can Need, take. Um, needle turn applique is mine. 
Okay. Which a lot of people it puts their heart rate up. Yeah. Puts mine down. Yeah. It's it's the interest intricacy and the smallness of it that I love. Mm. Um, and that's why I've got to get Rob back into cross stitch. Do you know my husband cross stitches? No. Do now. He's amazing. Yeah. And Hardinger. Okay, he can have it. So he did, <laughs> he did it. <laughs> yeah. He did it a long time ago and it used to be his um, yeah, I know. therapy and I've got to get him back to it because that therapy's necessary. I mean like you know, we live such busy lives. Yeah, a lot of a lot of a lot of girls love English paper piecing for that reason yeah. too. But I think that's but that's what uh, what we. But it needs prep work, whereas this yeah, doesn't. Yeah. Now look at that. It's so Sweet, pretty. Isn't it? Yeah. So pretty. I'm pretty. pleased with this one. And this and it's again, it's just all one yeah, thread. These are the, yeah, these are the bunnies. See, that was the bears. That's the bunnies. Yeah. Oh, that jolly phone, it doesn't give up. She's does popular. It? All right, you're doing that one. Oh, okay. And this one here is the farmyard, and I've left the fairies behind. Sorry. The fairies are still in the garden. Yeah. They're in the garden. I think they're in the box, but anyway. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Okay, there's a little farmyard, and what's the favourite? Oh, look, there's the cat. Look, there you go. There's Ginny and the cat. There you go. Anyway. Oh, there's yeah. Miss Jin Jin. Uh, that's been banished. She got the message, didn't she? She knew. She was straight out that window. How can you see anything from that? Oh, okay, there you go. Ah, oh, there you go. Just can. <gasps> they duckies. Yeah, there's all the farm animals are on there, so, <clears> and <throat> the kids, the kids love it. You know, they they know their animals. I, I just think it's a great reference book as well, just mm -hmm. for different shapes and and for using it. You know, whatever you want to use it for. Besides the candle wicking as well. Oh my god, they're beautiful. <gasps> Look at them. <laughs> and 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 the colour this one colour's gorgeous. Hey look, I just remembered something. What? When uh, one year one year um because normally done I've got it in the cream as well somewhere, but these show up better. Um, Home and Away had one in on their baby. Did they? Yeah, they did, yeah. How did you they, know? Did they ask you for it? No, 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 no. Someone had done it, and um, it was on one of the cribs of, I mean, the, the, of their sets, and and there's my oh. book. So that's pretty exciting. That that would have been. That's very my claim to fame. Small, but it's there. Yes, yeah, see, Fiona takes her stitching to work. Yeah. Yeah, just when you can. I'm at stitching everywhere. When life got too stressful, and we were up at the Sydney show, when they used to have the toll booth still on the Sydney oh. Harbour Bridge. I used to go to Tim when we'd be going home at night, I'd just go, I'd love that job. And he'd go, why? I said, because in between, you could every now and then, you'd be getting paid to sit there, just sit and stitch on the night shift. It'd be pretty good. A bit silly. All right, so, right. Um, so we've got, now, talk oh, to yes. me about these. Okay, I've got a couple of these quilts left, quilt kits left. This is a lovely, um, it's called Sea Spray. It's not my design, it's Monica Poole's design. It's all done as a quilt as you go. You need it's to whiz around and get me the kit. Do I? Yeah. And I've got a couple left that aren't going to the show, so I thought it would be beneficial to yeah. here. So should and we hold, should we hold we've got a super special price on them. Now so we, you, so the story one. is you've packed pretty much all ready to go to AQC, haven't you? Because yep. you've got yep. this weekend, then we've got the soiree, but yeah. your stuff has to leave for... On the 19th. On the 19th. The, 19th, the day after soiree. So if it's, so not in the, if it's not in the palette, it's not going. It's it's already not going. Yeah. yeah. So, so this is not going. Um, so this was just a little special we decided to do for today. Yeah. Anyway. So if you colours. have a look, Steve's popped up. We've only got three of these. Yeah. Um, and you've marked this down. I know, but I forgot what I marked it down Massively. To. I know, massively is right. Steve. <laughs> he's gone. He'll be back. Oh, he's probably gone to do another one. Um, but have a look. There's three of them. But you've yeah. taken a huge. Yeah. A huge I looked color. at it. it it's like seventy five bucks off or something. No, it's more. It? Is it? <gasps> I love that. Anyway, that's. Um, but in this one, it's not only the front, um, the back, the backing fabrics are included because they're all. Ah, part, they actually, have well. a look. Yeah, because it's not as cool as you go. You've got to have it at the same time. And you use the same fabrics, so that's all included. So it's all in. Yeah, so okay. it's really good value, and it's just a superb colour. 
Well, we did yeah. ask you to for bring all specials girls. just for today's my, show. My um, granddaughter loves these colours. She's not a pink or purple girl. This is mm -hmm. these are look at these. These are cool. Oh, these are frosty. Oh, oh, I'm wrecking the joint. Frosty dots. Those. So they're in, and all oh, yeah. <gasps> all of that. Mm. Okay. So I love yeah. that, and, and, then, and you've got another one. Okay, I've got another one here. This smaller, really great girls quilt, and. There we go. It's called Stargazing. It's got lots of stars on it. And the fabrics so are exactly are, what's these in the pattern. Yeah, and paste. these have been applicated, and applicated on. on. Huh. Yeah. It's lovely and fresh. Yeah, and, and again, it's a quilt as you go. So. Not, the backing's not included in this one. Yeah, that one's awesome yeah, too. Yeah, okay. but that was drastically reduced too. Right. Have you got the kit over there? Yes. There. Now, what about the cushion? Yeah, I fell. I was right no, but is the cushion? No, the cushion. No, the cushion's not included, but the pa it's in the pattern. All right. Yeah. So. So you could, if, if you've well, got actually, any scraps left. If you had, I reckon that there will be enough fabric in there to do the cushion as well, because it's only white and there's plenty of background. And then the, this is all scrappy, isn't it? So I'm, I'm sure there'd be plenty. But it's exactly what's in the. So they are exactly the same. Okay. Yeah. yeah. And there is. A, Oh, I'm wrapped. You bought these because we don't stock things like this, so it's yeah. and they're on special, so it's nice to grab them. Well, it something. was it was 140, and I reduced it to 95. Oh, I oh, know it's a giveaway. Oh, All right. I'll just give you a little look. Just it's just nice sometimes just to take five seconds to just give you a closer look. So there's all the yummy fabrics that are in that one. I I actually think at that price. You, I just want it for the fabric. I know. <laughs> Never mind the pattern. Don't worry, I kept a bundle for myself. Did you? <laughs> yeah, I did. I did. So look at that. I hit it. It's very nice. I know. They're just really sweet colours. Okay, so oh. you can have that. And then this is because you have one left. One. So one explain. Only. One only. It is the Lonely Orphan. Which is the Double Happiness Quilt. This one. Yeah. And... It was in something. It was in the Homespun magazine. It was oh, their okay. block, block of the month in the Homespun. And there were some, it's exacting fabrics that are in there. And we have one lonely, one lonely quilt, quilt left. Kit. left. Yep. And you and don't remember what you marked this one down to? Uh, I don't know, something really outrageous. Um, Stevie, we need you. Yeah, because. We can't um, No, I know. Hey, I don't need him. You don't need no, him? No, I, I reduced it to 175. From the what? Pat, the pattern's 40. Um, yeah, it was 250. So it was 250 and it's yeah, down to 175. 175. Sorry, Stevie, we do love you, but we're good now. Mark found the piece of paper. So this is exactly as it was yep. in the magazine. And if you do want backing fabric, I fail to bring that. There's still plenty at work. Mm. Oh, I know, it's gorgeous, isn't it? I would keep it for myself, but I know I'll never do it. Only because I have We've got a, lots of other stuff to do. Oh, my goodness. I have to live to um, 300, not even 200, 300. Well, wow. there you go. There you go. Better have your wheat fix. Oh, or a Barocca. Or a rocker, or yeah. two, mm -hmm. or three. Mm. All right, you can have that too. Thank you. Margaret now knows how confined the space is that we work within, and that everything kind of has to work. That's all right. But we'll do some outside ones. We're doing ones at the farm. We're doing ones at the farm. We're doing ones at the farm. At the beach. And at the beach. Yeah, we're going to the beach. We are. Okay. Oh, are we going to talk about soiree? Let's talk about soiree oh, okay, so. before we do your other beautiful things. Okay. So, she who is not here, our colleague, our colleague who is swanning around in France. And we, we decided it was okay for her to go, didn't we, originally? Yeah, that's so. We could run amok without her. <laughs> we could make, we could we make, make all these decisions and she would just have to say, yes. It, it's much easier um, to have a, a quorum of two instead <laughs> of three because there's no deciding vote. No. So, um, yeah. 
But anyway, she's having an absolute ball over there. She's, she's been to Nantes. Nantes. Um, she's been um, exhibiting there and selling there. Yeah. So her um, book, her book that came out two years yes. ago, she didn't even get to go and do that yeah. with Cook Mania. So all the girls are over there: Margaret Mew, um, 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 yeah, Judy all Newman, wigs. all the big wigs, all the all the big wigs that do reproduction, twelve, oh. Civil War, all of that real yeah. antique looking. Is Michelle Yeoh there too? I don't know, I can't remember now. Oh, I don't know. Anyway, so they've all been, all been in Nantes, which is, was a big thing um, to be on again. And then she went back to Paris, and now she's going to visit her son. Her son, who's a Michelin star chef. In I mean, not just an ordinary chef, but a Michelin, a Michelin star. star. He was not on famous people's cruise boats at But the he's moment. been on a master chef. He, he has been on Master Chef, and uh, he's currently working at a restaurant in the Caribbean. Yeah, in the Caribbean, which they're just. Oh, look, she's just taking a few few days off just to visit him. You know. <laughs> <laughs> we will get her back next year. We will get. I her don't know back. how. I don't know how. Because we're going to Birmingham. Okay, but she'll be at Birmingham as well. She's not and, coming on and, that and and not only that, but while she's been away, she's been invited to teach in know. yes, in several European countries. And one of them was Holland and I said to her I would translate for her. And um, so if far she, she hasn't got Scotland, back to me. If she, if she does more than Scotland, I can translate for her because she <laughs> Anyway, so it's but kind of but um, in fairness, she is well she's sought uh, sought after as a tutor and we're lucky to have her at our soiree. Yes. Yes, and um, we'll be thrilled when she comes back so she can do the dishes. <laughs> Shall we fresh off the plate? Oh, that's right, and iron the tablecloths. Yes. <laughs> and, and and we'll just walk around the room and sit with the girls because we've decided we like to do her workshop. So yes, we don't want to do, 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 yeah, do, do our own. own. Yeah. All right, so this is Good. the first time anyway that we've got all of the projects here together so you can have a look at them of what we're oh. doing on both days. So we'll do that. I'll just I'll yeah, pass things to them. Up. Let's just tidy up a little bit. Get them out. Just keep handing stuff to Steve. Yeah. Um, so there are six projects: three for Saturday and three for Sunday. Mm -hmm. And we we had to get to the point where we set one for each day because we couldn't we can't we can't teach six in the one day. I don't think that was ever the plan. No, it wasn't the plan. So <laughs> we d because you. We need three for each day, and we yeah. sort of have and to we say. and we wanted three different ones for the Sunday because there are so many girls doing both days. Yes, so they um, effectively will get six brand new projects that haven't been seen anywhere else or mm. sold anywhere else. They are brand new. Oh, I didn't show you the bags. Oh, I put it up on the thing. So the bags are here, oh, okay. and the place names. And the swing tags for the door prizes. You've been mucking around, haven't you? Yeah, haven't Cass been. and I have been busy. Mm -hmm. So, uh, we'll do Karen first. Yeah. Because she's not here. So, Karen, this is an overhead view of, of Karen's Saturday project, which doesn't do much because you're looking down the barrel of a basket. But if I do that... Yeah. It looks like such fun. I really want to do that. And, did you know, fun fact, mm -hmm. it's not paper piecing. Oh, I know. I know. Even better. It's not paper piecing. It is traditionally pieced. Yeah. And Karen is the whiz on tricks... Oh, I know. On Have how you seen how it? she knots her thread mm. and how? It, yeah, yeah, yeah. Really clever. So these kits. So you'll have this beautiful bag, which I didn't get out, but I probably can. They can, they can visualize it. It's a lovely. It. It's black. <laughs> it's a black paper it's a black bag, bag. <laughs> and it's got a, a designer swing tag on it with your door prize number. She fiddled around all night with that. I did. <laughs> um, and it has a white. Did you did you recognise the black vase? Yes, 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 yes. Which I bought in Berwick at the op shop on yep. the day we had our uh, initial inaugural soiree meeting. Meeting, yes, that's right. Uh, marathon's actually what I'd what like to buy. What did I buy? Oh, crystal ball. You bought a crystal ball. Oh, great so, op shop. So the the kits, just so you so you get an idea of what you're going to get with your value with your with the soiree, all of the kits, Margaret, of, of what they're at least fifteen at least fifteen dollars retail, aren't they? Oh, at more. least they're more. Nine they're, all, they're, they're all. It's all ridiculous. They're all more. We've all started off with. We've, we've started, gone big. Yeah. Are we? we so just, if I honestly, we just want success. We just want to have a really good time and be successful. So if if these were selling on Chandler's Cottage, they would be the same as my tidy ups, my Walker bags, and everything, which is twenty five. Yeah. I think this 
This, this would be more, 25. That's more. Yours are 25, and the whole yep. thing's 75. I know. With morning tea. And I know. Out and we're cooking out. for nothing, girl. I've just, well, it sounds <laughs> like we're trying to sell it to you, but we're actually standing here realising, what have we done? So that's... These are what Karen's packs. Now, they're all evidently a little bit different, which is really nice. Mm. She's purposely gone through and mixed and matched lots of colours that will blend together. And you've got your little template in here. So that's all in there. So that's that one. And um, where are you? Oh, you're up here. That's right. <laughs> These ones? Yeah. Yeah. So this is... Yeah, they're my pink cushions. So you get a choice mm -hmm. of... Um, see, I did I did this this one first, and I was just going to make them all in sort of traditional candle wicking colour, uh, tone on tone. But then I had a little bit of fun and I kept moving, and I've just done a couple of other colours. So the three colours will be available. So they'll get one in their pack, but they could come to you on the day. And oh, and look, switch they, can, they can, yeah, no problem. There'll be plenty of stock to turn. And I'm sure Fisher likes that one. They've yeah. all been talking about which colour they like. Yeah. So I've just done the, you know, the apricot one and the blue one. But this is, so this is, mini, this, this is stitchery mini sampler, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. It's just, yeah. how And there are nine different stitches in there, so it's actually a learning Whoa. project as well. So. Um, Margaret? Yeah. Is yeah. Ralph responsible for what's yes. in here? Yes. Yes. So Rob's doing the scones. I know. And uh, be a Rob's, death if he Rob's doesn't doing do it. the pin cushion inserts. Yeah. So it is. Steve will be there setting up. It's definitely family affair weekend for all of us. I know. Really nice. So they're not wearing a jockey yet. They're not. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Oh my god. I know. <laughs> <laughs> they're not. I'm so they're my brother beautiful. Dress as Santa one year too. <gasps> I know. I made Dad dress as Santa once, but it wasn't for work. And he was so nervous, he had to have a couple of beers before he did it, and then he was the best Santa they'd ever seen. Um, um, because this is also beautiful and classy. Hmm. I went bling. I just you because know. that's. But we're all doing um, our personality, aren't we? You know, I mean that bling is your oh. is your trademark. Well, bling has been my trademark. Trademark, and this own. and this is mine, and this is Karen. Yeah. So, so yes. I've gone bling. So my so my kits have actually got this grey melba, which doesn't exist yet, and it still won't exist when we get to the soiree. The way the shipping lines are going at the moment. So I air freighted in straight from Japan. Uh, 10 meters mm -hmm. of this and most of it has gone into the kits um, and so you get this and the frame and this why I'm showing you this because guess who hasn't got her kits assembled <laughs> so there's the frame all of the fabric and this is actually reverse applique so you're going to be cutting down and pre-shaping um, a little archway here then you're going to have your silver underneath and then I, because I'm not really a stitcher I've just done a really nice little simple embroidery over the top and uh, either myself or Emma. Emma has scrutinized my stitchery. I got a seven out of ten. Yeah, you ask him. I've got it padded at the moment but it's like it is a little bit like my glasses case but we've now got a little base so it will she'll stand up. So that is my Saturday. Um, I will have how a few extra colours available, yeah. but I like it in this one. I do too. How much fun is that? If you, like, effectively... Like you if we mix and, and match... Wine. No, no, you get like that and that. Actually, the oh, blue one's together. better with that. And that. And this is what you get for the day. It's incredible. It's incredible value. That'd be good. Yeah. Love it. I think in the corner there it is. Hiding under a bushel. I don't think you'll miss one of only one. No, I'll, you know, like... Typically, how I am at the moment, I'll have blamed myself and decided, well, I've put it somewhere safe. You know? <laughs> All right, okay, so that's Saturday. Saturday. No scones, but a fabulous morning tea. But there'll be pistachio semolina pears. Excellent. Let's see. There'll be a different stuff each day. Of course, there is. I'm, I'm baking up a storm. Me too. I always bake extras, you know. I was, I think I did 160 yo yos. <laughs> I know the boys will raid the fridge freezer. So yeah. some, so you have to understand yeah. some of the things that we're doing. We actually have to freeze ahead of time because mm. we there's no way we could do it leading up to the slurry to do it. Oh, I'm going to have a breakdown all at once. Mm. Yeah, no breakdowns. Um, but we some are frozen and then some will be done fresh. So yeah. I'm doing some fresh at the last minute and 
Well, yeah. some of mine is too that doesn't freeze well. And I have a default mechanism. You all know what that is, don't you, Pam? <laughs> I might get stuck. Yeah. Mum will do some. Yeah. The girls will know Mum's cooking. All right, so Sunday. Okay. Sunday. Sunday. Sunday, fun day. Sunday, fun day. Sunday is going to be a fun day. Mm -hmm. Sunday is going to be a bit different, isn't it? Really? What's that? Well, are we, so we've got lots of specials mm -hmm. as well at our pop-up shops at the mm -hmm. soiree. Yep. We're doing lots of special stuff. Um, I might do a few more on the Sunday. So I don't and the other thing is being in Garfield, home. you're actually not that far away. If you had an absolute bumper day on Saturday, you can go home and get more. That's true. It is true. So there's no excuse for not having a great no, Sunday we'll stock. Have a good, we'll have a good yeah. Sunday stock. But I also don't want to take anything home on a Sunday. I know. So there might be extra specials on Sunday. I'm just saying that now. If you're thinking about which day to come. Mm. Come Sunday. She's ruthless. I am ruthless. I was ruthless <laughs> yesterday. These are Car This is Karen's project for uh, the Sunday. They are the kits. Again, she's done a collection. There'll be one in your bag and you'll be able to do little swapsies with everyone else on the table. Or you'll be able to go to Karen and say, have you got one in this colour my mate's got? They're, all of that will be possible um, to do. And this is the project. So it is much smaller than her Saturday project, but you said that the, the, the oh, just technique's the way, just really just different. Just the way she does it. I just like, um, I watched her and I just think, I want to do that. You want to do and it? it it's, the way she technically does it and the way she knots up and finishes off, um, there's a lot to be learned in that small project. And it's got walnut shells in it. She's got all these little like crushed walnut shells. Isn't that hey, amazing? Hey, there's rude things going on here. Are they rude? Who's being rude? So they're all being rude. Really? Yeah. Yvonne, get on a plane. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to be rude. Um, yeah, Joan says she'd never put any pins in them. She wouldn't put any pins in yours. In mine? No. She's going to wreck them. Well, Linda's but coming. You've got to have a nice pin cushion to look nice, you know, yeah. and then you have your ratty one that you work with. So Linda's coming. Uh, Linda's coming on Sunday with three other lovely ladies. Excellent. Um, sorry, and just just to recap on what I said yesterday, if you missed it, I'm seeing Rosemary Crew, and I saw your request come through. If you have requests of who you'd like to sit with, whether it be friends or perhaps the Chandler's Cottage applique sampler girls or Facebook Live girls or be mindful girls, you can pop that in a note to me. You just won't, may not get a response straight away because as you know, uh, poor young poor young Cass mm. is sitting up in a hospital bed with young Alex at the moment whose um, appendix decided to explode like Mount Vesuvius, poor little baby. Mm. So she's a little bit limited on what she can do from the hospital. She'll be back on deck in the next couple of days, but just send them through and we will confirm them all for you. Because she is sort of like wedding director, who's sitting with who, what, well, and where. She's the she the, is the girl the glue that makes it work. Um, Barb, next year is the answer to her question. You know what her question is? Next year, what? when can she buy the kits? So if you if you live a long way away, like Barb does, we the kits from this year's soirees we will most likely make available late this year or next year when we've run. All the ones that we want to this year because we really want to keep them. I think exclusive. the answer to this is yes. Come on, make it up as you go. No, no, I'm not making it up. Yeah. If we have brand new projects up and running for the next one, then the previous ones can go on the market. But until we have something that's, well, that's up, right. and up and running, we can't. Yeah, we so can't. So the answer to that is shortly, and I think she'd have, think like everyone, we've probably all got plenty to do in mm. the meantime. Rose, I had a retreat. It was called the um, Creative Escape, and it was going to be in the Dandenongs, and it was all booked. And I had 65 girls coming from all over Australia for it, and then COVID hit. So Rose just said, when are you girls going to run a retreat? Uh, we're not really sure. We would love to say that we'll run one, but I think there's, there's, a, there's a quantum leap between organising a hall and running a retreat with accommodation and yep. things. And so yep. we we haven't done this for a while, so we want to get back into it. But thank you for asking, and we will put you on the top of the list when we do do one. Sylvia, um, Sylvia gets an extra Florentine at the retreat. Good. Because she said, the value is talking to you girls and just getting some of your knowledge. Mm. Oh. oh, that's nice. Extra Florentine for Sylvia. Yeah. She gets an extra one. That's it. Um, We'll be at, I don't, P, Patch, uh, uh, come on, PBQ Saturday, Linda, what's P? Patch, 
work. I don't know. What's PBQ quilters? I don't know. I try and make something up. It's Pakenham, or it's Pakenham Beaconsfield, or it's I'm trying to work out what it is. Yes, Rose, that is correct. You will have to come Sunday as well. We will look after you if you come both days. Uh, Fiona's going both days. Oh, Palm Beach Quilting. I didn't know. I didn't know Maureen had an acronym for her business. Palm Beach Quilting. I didn't know. Palm Beach. No, it's just down the road at Caram Downs. It's not Palm Beach. <laughs> All right. Sorry. Sorry. This is this is Sunday, and if any of you don't know what it's stuffed with, yeah, it crushed walnut shells. I don't know how she gets it in there, but that that's part of the workshop, isn't it? Burning where that cubby hole where, is. Where is it? Oh, I can't find it. You, find, you look for it. I know. I'm going to have to have a magnifier. Oh, no, I can't see it. Anyway, I want to do that. Catherine's calming both days. Yes, you are. I know. I don't. Right, so this is oh, me. I'm okay. saving you for last. Oh, good. This is my Sunday, and no, my kit's are not finished. Or oh, they're, they're cut. You yeah, it's, irre it's irrelevant. I, you, you fake that bit until you get them done. The reason, that, you know, what's got left to do? I have to. They can't I have be to cutting because I've cut them all. Guillotining and cutting all the cardboard that goes in the kit. Is that all right? And I had to get Jen to send me more of the felt. Mm. Excuses, excuses. This is my um, Sunday projects. This is my little notebook made with under the Australian sun butterflies. So when it opens out, you've got your full butterfly. So everything, everything's in the kit. The palette, um, the hand dyed Sue Spargo wool in the inside, uh, the cardboard that's used for setting it, and the skein of the black and the bead and everything is in there. And then wait, there's more. Are they over there on the shelf? Can you pass me the... Oh, look, I can be delving, delaying. So also on the day, for those of you, you all know Emma. So Em's there as well. She, uh, we're the three girls, but she's the, the go between the maitre d', the front door girl, the run the pop-up pop shop, run around, help. And also a backup because we're really, really... Mindful. Mindful of people bringing home some exotic Caribbean bug <laughs> um, or, or we are mindful of COVID okay. we are mindful of all sorts of things that might slow things down on the day or one of us might be down or we just don't know but we we don't want anything to affect what we're doing so we've got a couple of other girls okay. coming on board to help on the days with shops and everything and Emma is as you know brilliant embroiderer so she will be there and what she did just to outdo herself the fabric that you fussy cut your butterfly from she has just to demonstrate to you what else you can do with it she's made up the chatelaine our chatelaine pattern oh, that's clever with all the little bits left over so there will be uh, a special um are the pegs part of it or are they just holding it together no they're just to show you oh okay that you can put your wonder oh on okay right okay your pins yeah that's so right i thought it was still gluing together and i'm thinking that's interesting <laughs> So you got your scissor keeper. Yeah. Oh, she left it a chocolate. She has. Oh, no, I thought it was a chocolate. I haven't got my glasses on. It's the leftover wall. That's not exciting. That's not very exciting. And it's cotton. And it's cotton. So that, and we will have uh, this on display and a, and a little pattern special Good. on the Sunday um, as part of that project. So you get your little glasses, pencil case. Yeah. And you've got enough to make the book cover. Fantastic. So that will all be there, and she can show you how that all works in her spare time. Oh, look, she even took two of the butterflies off. Look at this. And made that. Thanks, Steve. And, uh, and, and made a little padded butterfly pin cushion. So there you go. That's pretty cool. Um, and then yours. Oh, yes. Yeah, mine. Is here. So tell me about this. Ah, oh, they're just a me. needle case. Just, just uh, a needle case. Well, it's done just in the um, Liberty Fabrics. And I've got some random buttons at the moment. Yes, yeah, so have I, Catherine. I just don't know what I've done with them. Okay. My and glasses on the kitchen table stick. go. It's got a little pocket here to pop your scissors or a tiny weenie hoop or a small project. Then you've got two little pockets to put your thread. 
and a piece of felt for your needles flips over but you'll be doing the embroidery which will be pre-printed um there we go there's a kit you've got the so kit the yeah so the it'll be <gasps> screen printed for you look at that that's i've just drawn that on because i'm still waiting on the screen printing but, right, but it looks today. like that won't it? yeah it'll be the same same fabric and it'll be screen printed like so so you just sit down and, and go. yeah and then oh, you've got all the fabric look, look yeah Whoa. there's your thread your threads and ooh, I got everything in there no because yeah, you're on the overhead i'm on the overhead so okay you just, you're know. on that one good okay Sorry, did I just give everyone a red finger then? I'm really sorry if I did, but I didn't okay. mean to. So, I've done it in three colourways, and I can't decide which one I like best. Me neither. Yeah. I quite, I quite like these fabrics. I think they're quite divine. Well, we, we don't have this one. We've had this one in stock, yeah. and that's been really popular. Yeah. Um, but that's... Oh, look at this. See, and this is just... They're just really sweet. I really like that. And, uh, and then the other one is the blue... You know, in keeping with my Delft dream. Um, is it two pockets? There you go. There you go. So this is just done in a fishbone I'm just gonna get stitch, them close a bit of back stitch, and the colonial knots. And it doesn't take that long to do. So. Can you get a little heart button? Yeah. I don't know what buttons we'll have. I just randomly sewn those on and I'll work the buttons out shortly. But then everyone will have a different one. I know, but... If you saw my jar of buttons, I could continue to pull something out. But anyway, if you're honest, so that's so. So, so you get these, one project, and you get to choose whichever. So what we'll, we'll pop one in the bags, and then if the girls want to do a little swap -a Oh, yeah, that's it. And okay. if you find that you know everybody wants blue on the table, I will more than likely have some under the bench under my workbench. Okay. So. Can I show them what else you're going to have of mine over here that you made? Me? Oh yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yes, I came with a surprise. Um, oh, Lisa's always it? terribly generous. Where and is it? Oh, thank God, God. I lost it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no, no, oh. that's your marbles, love. That's um, marbles. And um, she's always terribly generous. And I thought, well, it's time somebody did something for Lisa. Oh. So I did oh. this little project, um, I, mainly because I've hung on to her fabrics that I was borrowed and never paid for. And <laughs> um, so I thought if I make her something, it'll make Look. it up. So, when, so. When, are you, when are we getting these? Shortly. He, the, he, that was the screen printer today, the oh. ring, and uh, he's on to them. I've got that done in the talk as well. And Look we could do it. Yeah, I was, I was really you thrilled with mine, that. Mine, mine. Yeah. And to be able to just use any of your fabrics, because I've got all of them. <laughs> Rob, said, can I have some? One day I said, just cut your own. I'll just yeah, I did, yourself. but I, I took them home for, for a lend. So I could match them up with something and I haven't returned them so I've made something. So can I show them this one too because this yeah. this bites back because Margaret oh, yes, yeah, gave yeah, me yeah. this one yeah. at, on the same day and I still haven't done it because I keep debating. I can't make up my mind mm, okay. what I'm going to put it on but I'll put it there, yeah. down there like that. That is fun to do. Um, I it hadn't done. I've up. done it in the white, and I was really I pleased. Oh, that really is dark, isn't it? Yeah, this one is new. And I did it in the white, and I was th and Lisa said, "Margaret, you got to do it in black." So that's why it's now on black. <laughs> Look at that. And so, yeah. so I'm so designing those are the a bag. I'm, I'm designing a bag for it to go on at the mm. moment, and I've been, I've been tossing. Yeah, I have. Yeah. I have. Yeah. It's beautiful. Yeah. Right, so these come, so we've put all these up today as well, haven't we? Yeah, yeah. Right. and you, you're the only one that's got the black ones because there are only a few. There are being more, print, there are more being printed, but once they're out, there'll be two months before I get them. Yeah. Well, so these, so they come, we'll just show, these come like this. So they come in the pack and you can see here on the back, so you've got your threads and there it is, all printed on the black ready to go so there's no tracing or anything it's mm. it's literally just pick that, it up that would be impossible to trace and go yeah and so they come on yeah we've got them mm. on the natural and the cream yep. and the yes you do and then oh yes yeah oh. wait just wait wait there's always wait. more there's always more yeah. and look there's all there's all these so have have a look there's proteas and they're just here you go oh, you've got them all haven't my you? favorite which is your favorite this one, yeah, Billy's I agree. button. Billy's I've, button. I've never. Uh, like that up. Yeah. 
And then you're going to turn it round because I'm going to put it on overhead. Okay. So, the, it, uh, Paul Margaret, it's it takes a while, as Emma yeah, will tell nice. you, to under to get your head around the way the cameras yeah. work. Look at that. Yeah, it, that's super fun to do, and um, I loved it. It was one of my favourites. So when I've had to do that, I've done it a couple of times. I'm going to take those off there yeah. because oh, that is. I agree. Yeah. So that's it, like that. Yep. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah. And then we have <gasps> Ooh, the Banksia. You have a Banksia menzies. Yeah, there you go. Love doing the leaves on that. That was fantastic. And then, ah, now, bracken fern. You can't be without a bracken, can you? No. I actually didn't think it was a native, and uh, it I questioned is. it when um, when Cass drew it for me. I can just I know she said, "Well, I looked it up, and it's a native, Margaret." I thought, "Okay." It, well, so it now, is I have a, now I now have a new appreciation for our bracken that it is just all over in the, the way paddock. of farming. Yes, I was going to say with the paddock. Um, this is a, a long wattle, um, just slightly, well, quite a bit different than my other wattles. Different leaves I don't know if you've ever looked at wattle to see how many varieties of wattle there are the different leaves and different mm. yeah it depends which way you want to hang it gorgeous yeah that's got a bullion stitch in it. oh here we go this so this yeah, is so it this on the, the this is it on the cream yeah there this go. is where it's a crime we don't have an Australian mono, textile exhibition anymore on grass yeah I'm gonna turn the whole lot around yeah that was fun too, loved doing that. So you can sort of treat them like a little bit of a collection, wouldn't you? Well, I did. I, I have it home. I didn't bring the frames today because the cl the glass reflects back and then you can't see um, the embroidery. So it was best that I took the pieces that were not framed yet. So, All right, can you um, excuse me for a minute? Someone's being cheeky. Yvonne, the butterfly is not reverse applique and I do not need my cuticle sticks. Oh, okay. See, she's okay. the one that sent me the cuticle sticks. Okay. It's it's raw edge with blanket stitch, so no reverse. But you will need your critic your cuticle stitch for the project on the Saturday. There you go. She's a I think bugger. she's told you. She's a funny bugger. Okay. Okay. All right. What? Uh, oh, yeah, I love actually, it. I've never actually seen a. Haven't you seen one? No, no, not not live. Oh, oh I'll yeah. buy you one at Bunnings. Okay, thank they you. have them in. Okay, there you go. When they come into season. They are very hard to grow, yeah. um, and they, they're a bit hit and miss. They don't always flower at the gardens, okay. a bit like the stirp peas. It's going to be super hot. There wouldn't have been any stirp peas this year. No. Um, but the flannel flower is a fickle thing. Look at Andrew. That, that is a superb piece to be stitching out. If you just want some therapy, you just follow the lines. That was great fun. I like that. Yeah, I did too. They actually Ooh. look amazing when they're um, in the frame and they're, you know, I've got nine on the wall, you know, three three by three, and they look great. Mm. Um, so I'm really, I'm really thrilled. And that's what I did last year. That was my after, after certificate four in um, bookkeeping and accounting. This was my therapy. There you go. Jeez, did I need it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I didn't think it'd be that hard. I've, I've had a business for 30 years and I've been doing my own books, you know, but clearly not She's very doing well. Me go, Does this question make sense to you? Oh. Oh, honestly, I don't know where these tape teachers come from sometimes. You know, their questions are so obtuse. I didn't understand them. Sometimes I asked the accountant and he didn't understand it, so I wasn't the only one. What are these ones over here? They're things that I... Um, You're not sure about yet? No, no. Um, this is the pin cushion. Uh, the, yeah, it's pin cushion. Uh, and I've forgotten it's. Is it a Hakia? Is it no. a Grevillea? No. Nope. It's a Mum or no? Yes, it's Luca it's Mum a, something. Yeah, it, it is. It's a Luca something. Yeah. She reels it off her tongue like to impress people at parties. Then. Sporum? Yeah, a Leptosporum. Is it a Leptosporum? Something like that. Something like that. Anyway, that's it. If Gwen's and I, she's and I don't know me. that I'm altogether sold in, and maybe it's the, um, the yellowy green that I've chosen in here. So I think I'll, I'll do it again, and if I have confidence in it, then it will be screen, it'll be screen printed as well. But I don't know how necessary it is. And then this is the Waratah, and I haven't printed the Waratah because it sort of it didn't frame well with the others. And I think it's Does to it do, need it's almost to do like size. An, it's an oval so, frame or something. Well, yeah, but I, if I do, if I make a project out of it rather than try and frame it, then I will print it. Does that make sense? 
So yeah, that's yeah. true. So it, it just doesn't belong in that in that section of framing. Mm. Hello, and then, Jill. And then I did, and I thought this would be exciting, and I don't like it at all. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, but um, do you? They are. Excuse my French. They are a bugger. Yeah. Sturt P drive yeah. me nuts. So my girls doing the applique sampler. I had yeah. three attempts before I was actually happy with it, and I, yeah. I feel bad because some we did it pre-shaped, and some it's really challenged them, and it challenged it challenged me as well. And then when I first did Sturt P uh, on fabric, Robert Kaufman stuffed it up because they they didn't leave a screen for black. So my okay. P centers are green. It's just yes, done my head. They yeah. are really really Probably hard to do. Practice. Margaret's had a cold. Oh, no. It's just a bit of hay fever, sorry. Um, but. But you can't it, put it on black. There's that. But I also feel that I can probably resurrect. I feel, I feel, that this needs to be filled in. Uh, yeah, so it's And see, if it was red, if it had the um, red and then that black on top of it, then it would be okay. And I haven't gone back to it because I actually didn't like it. So they're the... Every every cupboard of a needleworker is full of these things that they weren't a hundred percent happy about. Oh, but well, I've got one here, and this one hasn't been. Michelle, plane's coming your has, way. Hasn't got, isn't kitted yet. Oh, do it, do it, do it, do it. Isn't kitted yet. This is this is why I wanted Margaret in today because you can see she's happy to talk through where she's at. It doesn't all have to be finished. No. It all doesn't have to be perfect. No, no, no. However, no. oh, here we go, wrong way. This is yes, yeah, it's finished. But I ha and um, some of the print screen printing has been done, but I, um, I've, so lost, I've lost, I've lost, no, sorry, I've misplaced the thread guide and what threads, what colors, and what quantity. So, no, that means that, means that I have no, to stitch for another no, month. I do, no, I do, I stitch no. for another month, do it all again. Yeah, and that's what I'm doing, but I'm doing the next one on black so that it is somewhat useful. Here you go. Yeah. Alright, now I'm going to give you Can that you one. It? If I give you that one, so we've got to get it trained up so that when I go overseas on holidays, Margaret can come and do your live shows. <laughs> there you go. So that's. So if I put. I'm no, I'm going the wrong way. Yeah. Anyway, what I'm saying is it's coming, it's just not there yet. So if thing. you're looking for a bigger project, Look um, at it on the black. Yeah, see, see, you love the black. I just think, well, I do, but only because I want to put my fabrics with it. Oh, okay. So for yeah. me, yeah. See, I, I just want to put that in a frame. Yeah. Um, I think it's too much work to put can in I, a cushion. Can I just go? Yeah, do that. This is the new yeah. black uh, flowering gum coming, folks. So, just you know, I can go and put the full floral with this, but I don't want to compete with this. So I would just want to frame it. If I if I had a sashing or anything around it, I would just want that. Yeah. Because it would make it just pop a little bit. But that's yeah. my bling mm -hmm. thought. We're all different. We're all different. It's all good. It's all good. It's Actually, all good. I haven't told Steve yet. Oh, Lordy, what have you done to him now? I've got... <laughs> it arrives at the door. What? Yeah. Um, I, <laughs> I can't look him straight. I've got um, this is my production. So, so Margaret knows how this works. See this little taggy tag. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This says five yards. So when I have to do approval of a fabric range, I can just get a hard little half meter sent mm. to me, half yard, to check that it's okay, and then or I can take a punt, take a risk, and I can get as much as I want sent air freight and then I've got it and then I use that to actually approve production so that backfired on us with the ivory and pink Melba because we got the 10 yards and we rejected it which is why everything's a little bit later than we planned but this uh, I got four and a half meters in and I only need Three and a half. So I was actually going to ask Steve to do a very special, special limited edition fat eight pack of all of the flower. Ah, now he goes, he goes. That's all. All of the flowering gums. So that's about thirteen or fourteen now. So it'll have the teal, 
the multicolored reds back in stock. So I've got the ivory. I can give you some of that as well. So there will be a limited link. We'll just do about eight packs and they will have a fat eight of every single color. And then that'll be it. And then we will wait for the actual production to arrive. And for those that have been hanging and hanging forever and ever for the um, cream and orange floral to come back in, he can't find the phone, <laughs> uh, which is this one. Uh, it's actually been ordered so we don't run out so we've got cream and orange coming back pink and teal your pink and teal the pink and teal what protea or whatever that you had before that will go with the pink oh, okay. and teal yeah, 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 okay. um so they will all be back in so we, we might be able to stop just for a little while on black and red and ivory red but it's all ordered and coming back in but um so we'll get these done and they will go up. Also, for those that are waiting, 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 waiting to see. Oh, wow. This finished. It's finished. Oh, so we amazing. have this Can you not in, use that on that same pattern? Oh, it's got to be new and special. Sometimes. No, and it's getting red leather handles. Yeah. So, um... We had this in the mint, we did the kit and we showed you it half done and the kit is there, it just doesn't have a picture of the bag. But if you wanted to sit, that's it. So I'll have these when we're back next week as well. But Oh, it's gorgeous. See, bling bling. Birthday's in November. Is it? Yeah. Oh, funny that. I've already got my birthday present from you. Oh. There you go. So look, see that yeah. on that? Yeah. I know, it looks good. Yeah, I just see, I don't I want... Think that's clever. I you don't, don't want, want it anything. overstated, yeah. And there lies the problem. You sit on. Look, I'll do a project like this, and then it sits there because the the right thing isn't there yet. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. And if you and if you do it any earlier than that, you're always sorry. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. you know, sometimes you just we, have to wait. Margaret, see my pile of things, and some things do just wait. Um, news flash from the cutting room. Steve's also really sorry. We talked about these yesterday. And uh, they weren't up. He just found found before they were still sitting in a, in a file full draft. So if you were looking for these, the Timeless Treasure Splatter Fat Quarter Packs that we have on special, they are now up. So if you missed out, he's combining shipping anyway. So you won't you won't uh, have to pay extra for shipping. So that's all good. Now I want to talk about the frames, please. Frames. These. Oh. I'm What's in the frames? I want this one. Things. This is my birthday, it's the 1st of September, by the way, Margaret. Spring. It's first of spring. I know, one so they didn't call her Blossom. <laughs> it was my nickname. <laughs> Sorry. Um, it was my nickname. Okay. Right, um, no, uh, framed, what's in that one? That's just, uh, oh, that's the sampler. That's, you know, so, so is this like a big version of the pincushion colour? Um, in principle, yes, but they're all different designs, and I've done different design. I've done oh, actually there are four. It's my light, girls. Look at that. Where are we? <laughs> I've done four. See, okay, right. How are we going? Oh, Flick's here. You are late, Flick. Now, where is the? The phone rang yesterday morning at eight thirty a.m. and I went, "That'll be Flick," and it wasn't. It was Gay. <laughs> Oh, okay. I nearly answered oh, the phone. Hey, flick, but it was it was gay. Okay, right. The first one. Oh, ring light. Sorry. Now you know all the lighting we've got here. Yes. Okay. The first one. The sampler is this side. Uh, can you see that? I don't know. Oh, where? Where? where I have no idea where we are now. Where there we are. Okay. Which one is it? This going. The, you go this way. See that there? It's that camera. Okay. So it goes, Okay. So I'll lay so this down. That's sampler number one. That's a small one, and I've used that in our. Look at it. Yeah, in our. So that's yeah. our pin cushion. Pin cushion. Okay. Then I went for this is sampler number two. Wow. Yeah. So, and that's slightly bigger. And then sampler number three. Who's got is Dutch this one? cottage in their stash? Because if you're like me, I'm going that yep. is a Dutch cottage. I know. Cottage I was thinking about time. doing a another a book, but. Having one big enough that I can put a six inch hoop in it, you know, like this, but do the six inch hoop. So the hoop in the book? In, in, yeah, in the book, it should fit, and that, and then I'll use those same blue, and maybe that'll be. So people Nagami, get the book. Nagami's, yeah, 
um, to right. see, see if you see what I mean, and I'll build on that. It'll fit your six inch hoop in here, your little scissors in there, and you put all your other bits and bobs in it. So that was my thought with that. So that's sampler two. Fonda, was it? That was my beautiful late mother in law's birthday, Anzac Day. Okay. And then sampler three. I They're all putting their birthdays up now. <laughs> oh, yeah, uh, I look, that's their birthdays, but I bet they don't put the year. No. No. Don't, Fiona. And we won't do be either. Not, don't, don't. Because she'll reckon if I put the year up, I'll get it. Oh, look at the yeah. red. And the red. Yes, oh, the bigger one. The and I've done those as oh, look at that. Yeah, the cushions. Rhonda cushion Berry, size. Rhonda Berry, red work, red and, work, alert, um, alert, alert. I've got another one. Well, this one, it's in a frame and it's <gasps> in purple in those. Oh. But each of these are different. So I haven't gone from this small one and then just made a little bit bigger and photo. They're all diff They're all completely different. You won't find anything so that is I the same. So I sit that. So I went through, this was... This was a phase I that I did. I did some YouTube clips with a group, and they were to. Um, so I'm just putting that and on. it was about learning, and there are nine different stitches. So I, I did it for the basic stitches. So I needed to have a project that you could comfortably do and not stress over and learn to do nine different stitches. And that's what this was about. Well, and I really like yeah. it. I think it's just a bit fun, a bit contemporary. What's this? What is this? Oh, that's another thing in the make. You know how you got those things? Anyway, that's on a lid. That's on a Fowler's lid. And I haven't quite finished it because I, I'm trying to find a base so that then I can put a, something around um, it. It's coming together. I'm stealing half those Fowler's jars, so you better grab what you want. Yeah, yeah. no, it was a lid that was past its use by date. So okay. um, tell me what I'm looking for. Oh, oh I know. I know. So I went with that same thing. We need a demo and, too, too, by the way. A demo one? Oh, seriously? Oh, yeah. Oh. Okay, these were, this is Just going to be, this is a little project that. Oh, sorry. You're this not... is a needle, needle cover, the front, that'll be the pin cushion, and this was going to be a little <gasps> scissor keeper. Oh. So I went with the same theme. So now you've seen everything that I've done, and all of them are different. So, so will you have these? We're going to have a table at the soiree. Um, as I won't well. have this because I know I won't get it made. No, but all of these are available. So yes. we'll just have all of these on a. I think we're going to have pop up shops. Pop up shops are going on that side, and then we're having quilts on display on that side, and then up on the stage bit where we're going to do a little show and tell each day. We'll just have tables out with <laughs> karaoke machine. Not. Not. Um, we'll we'll just have tables out, perhaps with the you know samples of all the kits and things we've got there. But if we've also got stuff we're working on, we'll we'll have it there as well because I think I think it will just be really nice to kind of share. And Yvonne Chapman's put a full. Oh, they are. They're all putting their full full birthdays on. <laughs> <laughs> are you game funny girls? Lot, you are game. Yep. Does any of it fall on the soiree? No. Well, yes, yeah, someone's, but they're not coming. Yeah, well, uh, they're missing out. Uh, here we go. Look at them. They are loud and proud. Sylvia. Oh, you're the 31st of January. Steve's a January boy. Jill Cross, we are two days apart. Okay, yeah. will I clean up? Oh, jeez, I had a pink fit because Jill's really happy. I thought she was about 10, 15 years younger than she is. Okay, and so I you've made her I a happy girl. I died, yeah. I couldn't, but I still don't believe her. Um, good year, 1947, Sharon, I'm told. It was a good year. It, <laughs> 1960. Yvonne, you are only, you are uh, sort of in the same vintage as my hub hub. And this was a... Well, Fiona needs the same one in blue. What's this one? They're the needle. That's the glasses cases oh. that I was going to do, but the flex frames didn't come in so time. Could so could these be Nagambi? I think so. These are Nagambi. Yep. So these are getting the little flexy things. Hmm. They are beautiful. I love this. I have fond memories of these. Good. Sitting, eating something bad, watching. What? Julia, Julia. <laughs> look at your face. Oh, Julia. did you want to do the, the hair? Yeah, I do. And then, and then, what? I do, I do, I do. Then what? Well, I think we've done the traffic. I know the traffic's appalling. Did I did. Oh, oh, yeah, that was my demo piece, but 
surely they're going to see that at the soiree. They are going to see it. Can you do one, one I'll, I'll candle do a, wick? I'll do a colonial knot. One colonial knot. I'll do more And then one. let's pull this out. Because yeah, okay. What about you talk while I do it and they can watch me stitch? Well, they can't do both at the same time. What, what you listen to you talk? Yeah, no, they can't see what I'm showing them and watch you stitch at the same time. That's so funny. Stephen, you better put the kettle on. It's getting ugly. <laughs> oh, no, wait, wait, wait. There's more, but wait, 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 wait. Um, no, we need to say something. Yes. Please do not worry if you're gluten free. We need to say that, don't we? Because we're doing at least one or two gluten free. I am. Yep. Things for each day. I've done. So don't the worry. Florentines if you are, are gluten free. That's why I got excited. Florentines. I did them, and then I realised the Florentine is gluten free. Florentines are gluten free. I'm doing yep. my hazelnut macarons, so my girls in the Quilters so Life know what they are. <gasps> Quilters Life. I have to sincerely apologise. Well, no, Steve and I are, Steve and Stephen has solved the problem. So a lot of girls have gone, yeah, I'll go and join a quilter's life. And then they go onto the website. And so I do this to them, right? I do this. See this? This is a still thing. See that? Exactly. And then you push a button and then that's what they see. Isn't that clever? Mm -hmm. So Rob and I had forgotten how to actually change the still, so they haven't seen anything else for about six months. But, so they go in um, and you can join there, but if girls come through... Um, the website it actually tells them it's closed and that's because it's not a product that you actually buy through the website so it gets mm. a little bit technical however the legend himself has fixed that today so you can go in and read all about it and then it says join here and it will take you to the Podia site to join so we do apologize that we've confused you it's all good and it is real and alive just like Google says we're closed and the Google says we're closed because we don't have um, an address mm. of a business that you can visit so that's another little, that's Rob's challenge, that one. So Margaret is doing it without even thinking. So give me a second. She's doing two Wait, or I three. Am, I am, but, you know. Do you remember this? We have, we have this or had this as a kit on the website. I think there's one left. Is it? So for those that have done candle wicking before, would like to, this is a kit on our website. However, Margaret and I are scheming because this was the little banner photo I changed over to for today. Uh, of the little purse. So what we are scheming at the moment um, is to run a workshop at the Garfield Hall, aren't we? Yeah. I thought at we'd the start hall there. after the soiree. So there's a beautiful date to be announced. Yeah, but there's a beautiful little room mm -hmm. that we think may be more suitable for the. Oh, it's just a small workshop. room, but and the lighting is just amazing. Really so there'll be no excuses for good work. So the workshop will be this, the both of them together. But we'll start on this on the day and then you will go home with the full kit. So it's quite lovely because Margaret will spend the morning with you mm. um, doing the stitchery. Yeah. And then in the afternoon you'll spend, spend it with me doing bag and purse construction. Mm. And then you'll have this done and you'll go home and work on to your bag. Yeah. So that's what we're going to... Yeah, that's, 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 that's what we're offering. Um, and if that's something you'd like to do, just need to let us know. Mm. Um, and if it's something you think your group would like to do, or you've well, got, yeah, we got a group of friends... Whole... Uh, no, we don't have to do it in Garfield. We're not fussy. We could do Kitchen it in, table would be good. Oh, we could do it in Townsville. Townsville's nice. Townsville's nice yeah. at this yeah. time. <laughs> uh, no, no, no. Let's, let's all... Um, Anyway, we will start with uh, the offering will be made in in Garfield I first and we will see what happens from there on. Diana in Costa Rica's put hers up. You young thing, she's nineteen seventy seven, so she's ten years younger than me. Seven. I got married that year. <laughs> <laughs> you got married young. Kerry Lee. Oh, you're all so fun. I can't believe they've all put their birth dates up. You're hilarious. They're all proud. They're all loud and proud. Yvonne Collins said, no, you're not. Are you really? I thought Yvonne was my age. There you go. See? They're all looking good. It's yeah. the de-stressing from doing needlework that oh, keeps absolutely. us ageless. I That's well, it keeps marriages together, I reckon. Because without my stitchery, my husband would be dead. Can I tell you, do you remember, oh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be naughty now. You know how I cross the line every now and then. Do you remember, it? let's go back, way back. You all right? I won't tell the story about Daniel and, and the late Julie Wallace and stuff. I won't do that story. Mm -hmm. Do you remember that? No. Okay, no. I'll tell you what you said later. Oh, please, don't don't humiliate me. No, no, no. It was very funny. It was really oh, good at good. the time. Yeah. Um, for me. Anyway, no. Um, 
I've lost it now. What oh, talking thankfully about? she's lost it. Can't, let's move no, on. No, oh, no, no. At the shows, do you remember that lady? That, was she from Perth? Where was she from that used to come with the punch embroidery? Yes. Where was she? Was she Russian or was she? Yes. Oh, was she? She yes. was Russian. Yes. And she had attitude. Yes. And one of my beautiful girls, Amanda Davidson, um, Amanda Panda Designs, uh-huh. who's also our accountant, <laughs> just right. the way it goes, you know. I used to up the show with accountants, pharmacists, Leanne's the lawyer. Yeah. I used to have a very professional team. Oh, you know, you, you met them all. Yes, you know. Anyway, um, Amanda finished working for us and had a day spare and she asked her to work for it. And it was that Amanda decided after that that it was punch a living daylights out I embroidery yeah. because yeah. she yeah. would just go home with these samples to do for her at night time ago. Bang, bang. Oh, I know, I know. Down yeah. through them. Yep, yeah. it's great therapy. Is that the great therapy? It is great therapy. Look, so embroidery is really important. Look how much I've done then while you've been yakking away. I've been got banging on. on. Yeah. All right, now, you're going to have to learn how this works, as I said, for when oh. I go away and you're doing it. This right. is this camera. Over. See this one? That's going to be you. Right. Okay, so you need to line this. <laughs> right. So if I push the two button. Right. Yes. I can tell you're not paying attention. I am, I'm listening. Right. I just so don't see, understand. That's you now. <laughs> so if you go I've, that oh, way, you want me to that's stitch that you. Well, see, but you're not you're not saying Margaret stitch over there so they can see. No, it's right, I've got to line it so I can see. I'm nearly blind. All right. Okay. Perfect. Perfect? Yes. Okay. Hold your thread towards yourself, put your needle under from the left hand side if you're right handed. Take your thread over to the top. You're creating a figure eight on your needle. Put it back down into your work and pull it through. And then take it up again and do it all again. So under, over, and in. Pam Stanton got married in the same year as you. There you go. How relaxing is this going to be? I know. So I, add to this morning tea. Yep. Um, endless cups of coffee and tea on the side. Yep, that's it. There's it's bottomless cup, girls. Uh, I'm in charge of music. God forbid. Huh? No, come on. Okay, set up day music <laughs> is very different. There will there'll be some Glenn Miller jazz. Okay. Oh, um, we keep it cla- we keep it classy, girls. Girls, you know where Fiona doesn't have the, any, but I told her just to oh, wear just, some bling. Some just, bling or some pearls. Yeah, I we we talked the Pearls came up because it was an understated piece of piece of jewellery in the box that never gets worn, and we felt it needed an airing. And we're we're a classy lot of girls, so there we are. Yeah, aren't we? Yeah, classy. We just decided it'd be nice. So if you don't, I think it'd be if you don't have pearls, what do you think? A nice brooch, like a nice one of your grandmother's brooches, or just just a piece that just a piece that you've got in your jewellery box that needs some airing. It's going to be yeah. like, you know, I swear it's going to be like that little secret sisterhood thing after I a while. I think so. It? But uh, honestly, I've had, my mother gave me these. Um, it was a, a special occasion. And, you know, and the earrings. It was a really big deal. And, and she never buys me anything, so it was a seriously big deal. And um, I've probably worn them 10 my times Nancy. in 20 years. So I just think oh. it would be really nice to be able to. You know, yeah. appreciate them. Well, I took yeah. educate Steve found out today that this was Robert, my hubby. Uh, I used to say, "Oh, my husband buy, doesn't buy me jewelry. He could when we can aff- when we could afford and justify mm-hmm. it for a kid." So that was that was wedding. Uh, this was Phil, and this was Steve, and he was pretty impressed. That was the mother load. But I think mm-hmm. that these it was there was kind of a long lay by that happened from here to here, yeah. and I think that these were actually going to be for an anniversary, but. He decided to give them to me. Yeah. Then, so it's it's give these things an air and don't yeah. and um, don't forget. We, I might come back and do it actually before the soiree. Note to self. Um, do you remember we every now and then we come back and do that little evening bag pattern that we like to call the brooch bag. Mm. And I, you know, all of us have all got those brooches of our grandmothers and everything. We don't use them, and I go yeah. put it on the flap of a bag, just a nice little clutch yeah. evening bag. Yeah, yeah. Do you know? I will come back if you'll have me back. And thank you for having me. I, I, I've really lost my manners. Thank you, Lisa, for having my me today. My absolute pleasure. <laughs> no, but my father has a um, a leather jacket that um, since he passed, I, I grabbed it and I was going to make a, um, a 
small bag out of it, the handbag, mm -hmm. and, and he gave my mother all of these scarves when they were courting, and nobody wanted them in the family, so I'm going to use a, one of her scarves in the lining, Aww. and then my mum has... My mum has a skating medal, you know, for when she was in Holland, you know, like a skating competition. So she has a medal, and I want to put that on there. So I have the whole plan. I just never have time to do it. So I'm going to come back, and you know, come back with the pattern, and we'll do it. Yeah, we'll do it. We'll do um, recycling, refurbing, um, sentimental things that then become useful. There you go. There you go. Mm. Oh, yes. And uh, yes, put some collection of things we have. Door prizes. We've got door prizes. We've got lots of door prizes happening. And I just want to show you just... Karen, Karen didn't drop off her door prizes oh, there at home. Well, there better be something from France, I reckon. <laughs> hey, yeah. yeah. Let's so send that a message There's a collection. Now. Collection of girl, girly with girls. girls. They want door prizes from... Because she's left. The Karen Okay, bins, slash cutter. Sand. Slash cutter. T-pins and a selection of fabric. So, wait, 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 wait. So yeah. all of that. Yeah. Oh, so that's what that's a good yeah. example of a door price. Yeah. No, it's pretty good. So what's all this? Just more door prices. Yeah, no, no, I've got plenty. I, d I, I don't want to under under oh, the girls. I, I feel I feel there's going to be a little bit of a door prize competition on between the. Well, that's why I thought if I started it, then you would understand no. the concept, and you uh, you know. Yeah, right. You know how it goes. Right. Fleet, so Fleek Fleek and St Helen's Tassie, um, right. she can't be with us on the day. Right. And, which is really sad because we love flick to bits, but she's going to break out the, bring, the bling okay. and be with us in spirit. Excellent. And I will do, um, I am doing live feeds. Sharon Keys can't find the pearls. You keep looking, girl, you've got two and a half weeks. Pray and Anthony. Pray to Saint Anthony. Pray to Saint Anthony. <laughs> patron patron um, saint of all lost goods. Uh, I will do live feeds uh, from, that's why Rob's coming down as well, not just to bring the scones. Oh, they make the fine butternut, butter, I keep saying butternut, buttermilk milk scones. scones. good, it's really good. So uh, really good, and uh, yeah. so he'll be down with those, and we'll be doing live feeds from the show on the Sunday. Not the Saturday. Too nervous. Too much going on. I might do a few through my phone, but we're going to get on early and do one on the Sunday. Um, you're putting all that in. Yeah, you? I am. I am. I, I had a little find, and so she template, um, had pieces, a w wash pen, fabric, and a needle thread. Right. Yep. That's number two. Pressure's on. I know. Like I said, do you some, want to go and some put time together out no, the some, back now? Yeah, yeah, while you're not watching it. It's a fine idea. Just go through and I, think, I just um, thought I would show you girls how it's done. Oh, Sylvia <laughs> found her pearls at the op shop to bring. Fantastic. Excellent. Oh, I'm so impressed. Okay. We've got some yo-yo makers. They're the heart ones. And then the heart pattern. Oh, do I want that? Yeah, maybe. Okay, oh, yeah. and some Aww. different size fabrics okay. to add to your stash. So that I'm one's a quite eclectic collection. Right. So, and then this is uh, every hour, isn't it? Or something yep, like every, hour, every, every hour. Every hour. Every hour we do something. There's a door price. So you'll have, again, the designer swing tag yep. on your black bag when you sit down the table. Yeah. And it won't be going, I'm not going to do that. One, two, three, four, five round the table. I'm going yeah. to mix them all up. Yeah, you do that. Okay, this one's just all purest candle wicking, can um, pre-printed thread, needle, water okay. erasable pen, right. and a book. Yep, yep. So there you go. So that's my contribution. You're going to have to wait and see what Lisa's contribution is going to be. And we're certainly going to have to wait for Karen because she flies in, flies in. I just said in. before, she can't bring sand. It's not acceptable. From the Caribbean. I was going to say, she can bring Euro. <laughs> <laughs> bring Euro yeah, down. Euro. So all there right. you go. That's that's it, girls. That's, that's it. We did it all. And the place looks fresh as it should after a yeah. show. I'm, I'm okay. proud. Um, but if you can't come, tell your friends. Yeah. Come to the soiree. We, uh, yeah. we, we and, have, we don't, don't get us wrong, we have a lot coming, but we yeah. want it absolutely choppers. We want to really out, uh, outdo the event. And I think, well, this is speaking off screen now. Just, yeah, yeah, yeah. Speaking off screen. We, 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 we personally wanted to do it too, to encourage people yeah. to get, get out back. again. Yeah. Because yeah. We, we know better than anyone what it was like 
you did. You were stuck down on the farm on your own. Yeah. Um, I came home and cried for a month, losing my Spanish holiday from the quilt show. And, and you know, and we've all every everybody suffered in some form or someone, other. Someone, all yeah. of us lost yeah. a cruise, time with grandkids. There was just yeah. so much that we missed. And I think now that we can get out, we, we kind of forget that we're supposed to do things for ourselves as well. And that's what we were talking about this, this morning. This morning, I'm hopeless. That we just do everything for everyone else. Yeah. And we, all we do is work and we do kids. Yeah. And you know me, I'm totally absorbed. Literally, it's cutting kitchen. You know, we are home-based at the moment. Mm. And we have big plans not to do that next year, to, to move and do other things. So with with all of that in mind, if we're not careful, we're just going to keep rushing forward now mm. and feel like we're in catch-up mode and we've got to stop and look after ourselves. And each other. And we know that a lot of... Yeah. Um, our friends, customers, quilters, whichever group you would like to put yourselves in, all of that, all of that collective, are just kind of missing the point that now is the time to get out and do something yep. for yourself. Yeah, for yourself and for your fellow girls. Yeah. And so yep. if we fellow can women. in some way um, be that little incentive, people go, you know, so I'm going to go, I'm going to get out, yep. I'm going to go for the day. Yeah then that's what we wanted to do. And this is not our first one. That's the other thing. We want this no. one to be an enormous success so that so it's such big news. We're going to be all over Victoria in some obscure places like Patchy Wallach. <laughs> Patch, you and your Patchy Wallach. And I want to go to Witchy Proof. Okay, Witchy Proof and Witchy Patchy Wallach. If we, can, if, we can get, if we can get a crowd, we'll be there. Is Megan here? She's an Oyen. Now, so here's a question. This is very, very important. Diane yeah. is coming and mm -hmm. she's written loud yeah. and proud out here so I'm yeah. reading it back I don't have any stitching friends to come with and I'm a bit nervous about going alone not a big talker Diane what happens <laughs> is I go Diane's <laughs> coming listening. she's one of my Facebook girls so I will stitch you with Sharon Keys, Fiona like there are plenty of girls coming the, whose names will be really familiar to you from watching the show mm. and that you will feel like you know so I we off. we're doing the whole wedding planner thing the few days before. I just think you know, I don't know about you, but when you go to a show, an event or a yes. show, don't you talk to all the girls like you already know them? Yes. You know they we just come together because we have a um, we a have similar, a similar passion, theme. a common passion, and we get together, and that's that's what we talk about. All and right. Then, so Sharon yeah. Keys, you're sitting with Diane. There you go. I'm putting the two of you together because Sharon's gone, I'm the only one I know either. So you two are together, you are buddies, you are Facebook Live friends, mm. and we'll just we'll sit you together for the day. But that is true, and yep. we do I it... I just never have a problem. No. I went all by myself to Birmingham, and I've never travelled anywhere by myself because I'm a bit of a chicken. And I went all by myself, and I was in the queue, and I talked to all these ladies with different accents, mm. and then I'd be on a stand, and I'd have another new friend, and that's just how it goes. It, because we have that common passion, that's our common ground, and it's just easy. Yeah, it is yeah. easy. Oh. It's good. No, you'll be fine. Absolutely yeah. fine. And we will look after you as well. I mean, we. Yeah. There are so many of you. I've, yeah. I've never met face to face, and I've only met you through Facebook. Yeah. Through doing this, and I feel like I know you all. So distinct. We all do. We all feel like you now. I go. Emma. Oh, Yvonne's been on today. Are we talking again? And you know, those that have been with us, Louise. Like, I know some of them really well yeah. but some we just feel like we know you and so does Steve now so uh, it won't be it won't be strangers at all mm. do you know the traffic's going to be horrendous now what's time four o'clock no we're right on schedule everyone here will tell you this. we finish at four o'clock don't we? We, don't, we, don't, we don't we usually finish right, 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 right. Two. so but thank you for having me I've had, I've had a ball good uh, yeah it's isn't um, it weird because we're in this room together on our own but we're not they're yeah, all there yeah, I, know, I know I know and, and I know. thankfully I can't see anybody <laughs> Well, some of you, some of them are going to see you. Oh, they're all set. Fiona, you are worry. not shy. Oh, come on. And then they're going, oh, I'm shy too. I used to be really shy. And then I bought a business and I had to get pull myself out of myself. Anyway, I'm going to, I'm going to go home. I'm done. Do you want a cuppa? I'd love a cuppa. All right. Are okay. We, done? Uh, we are you. done. And you'll be happy to know that I know where the end of the live button is. All right, everyone. Thank you. Thank you very, very much for joining and thank us. thank you. Um, no show Saturday because... I'll be down with Margaret and her help family yep. uh, helping run their big fundraiser this weekend and yep. getting to know the hall. And then I will see you back here with... Hang on. I've got to stop. I've got to stop and think. I've got to stop and think. I've got to stop and think. Next week's going to be Wednesday. So there's a bit of a gap. I will see you uh, live here on Wednesday next week. 
Um, not Tuesday. Got to do a couple of other things with Emma on Tuesday. You know what? I might just pop in from, from your fundraiser. Oh, I wish you would. Can I do that? Yeah, do that. All right. Great. I might just pop in for a quick live check, so you check can out, the Check out the bone china, all the English oh, yeah. bone china. All right. So I'll pop in yeah. sometime over the weekend. That's Sunday, isn't it? We're yeah, set up Saturday. Yeah. Sunday to say hi from Margaret's event. But otherwise, I will see you at 2 p.m. on Wednesday afternoon next week. And I'll pop that up as event so you can set it as a notification. All right. Thank you all so much for joining us this afternoon and um, we'll see you next week. All right. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.